Hey, it's Scott's Test Dummies. I'm Scott. Bart. We got us a new Lot 40 cast strength, courtesy of Canada. Ooh, Canada, baby, Canada. I'm not revealing anything else to Bart just yet until we taste it. He has not, and we're going to test it. Blind like my shirt will make you style. Mostly blind style. Woohoo! At least for me. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah, Lot 40 cast strength. This is a new... I had a cast strength. Yeah, I poured a little bit while you were waiting. I know. But I didn't read the bottle. I just tried it. <laughs> Go pour something in. I was like, I had two clean glasses. I'm like, yeah, no, I phone? poured it. You were on the phone. So you already I, ruined I, it. Well, I poured a little bit in there. I didn't read the bottle. You said don't look at the bottle. I did taste a little bit because it was, it was... There goes the surprise. It was Maybe. aromatic. Well, I knew it was cast strength when I tasted it. But I didn't look at the bottle. I can't believe you didn't know I was sipping it. You were like on the phone. Yeah. I guess you were facing the Was my direction. butt towards you? It was. <laughs> I felt I felt a steady gaze on it. I figured you would have smelled. It was a long, lingering gaze. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you had the elbow perch earlier. This is I mine, did. right? This is good. You this like is what that? I like right you here. Like, you kind of I like saddled both. up. Both arms, but you could yeah. almost like swing, pivot a little bit and do the same thing there. I don't know. I think my knee would be on you. I'm bigger than you. Don't um, Lot 40 cast strength. This is a special edition. I haven't revealed yet. I don't know if you got it. No, I hadn't looked. Although, well, it's hard to tell because Canadian whiskey, they, they will distill like 100% rye, 100% corn, 100% whatever, malt. Then they blend and mix them together in their own little mm -hmm. machination. So um, I can never quite tell what's going on in Canada. This is yeah. So I mean, this is this is a, a rye. Um, I haven't looked at this the is ball at all. release release number one in this series. What? Wow. So, so rye okay. exploration. You want me to taste it again? I haven't read the bottle, so everything yeah. you're giving me is that. Okay. So first of all, I get a super strong uh, ABV. Alcohol is just pouring out of this. So I'm guessing 55. this is... Oh, you said it already? No. But, oh, I was thinking it was 60. 55.5. Okay. I was thinking it was higher than that. Um, and then I get this huh. like a dusty barn wood floor with the rye, but the rye isn't dill. It's more of a dry white pepper ground. With a bread, with a rye bread baking. So I'm looking for the notes that makes this the special edition. It's not on the nose. There is this heavy, heavy, malty, dusty. Yeah, and you get the barn. Rye, you get rye bread baking in a dusty barn, in a dusty old barn. It's like there's ovens stacked up, and they're just pulling the rye bread out. But you're getting the wood from the old barn, and then the warm bread, and all you want is a stick of butter. A stick of butter, baby. <laughs> want a little stick of butter? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, make that and uh, put that right on the rye. Little astringent. Mm. Nice palate, though. Sweet. Rye notes. Orange zest. Vanillas. Mm. Sawdust. Yeah. I was going to say, I'm getting wood. Wood. And it's wood dust. I'm not getting the orange. You got orange? Orange zest right up front. Dang it. I missed the zest. I got sawdust hmm it's like that kiln it's like the, the the oven's going and somebody's cutting wood they're cutting wood inside the old barn still getting something weird on the notes hmm. it's very very light not as much influence here for, from this special edition very good overall Special edition. Yeah. Hmm. What would that be? What comes out of Canada? Uh, a drop of maple syrup. <laughs> no. It nice. Would... It's. I mean, it's that. It's that sweeter rye, and you can tell by the color of it. It's not the the American, you know, uh, rye heavy mash bill bourbon. All right. Um, but 
it's that lighter, sweeter rye, it's Canadian rye, but nice overall, nice palette, nice finish. So the first lot 40 cash rank we had, we had ran into somebody, I think, and they gave us, but it was down pretty low. And you sent it home with me after we reviewed it, loved it. And then you were like, hey, let me try some of that. I'm like, it's gone. Mm -hmm. And you were like, what? You were like pissed. And I was like, well, I'm sorry. I didn't know you wanted any more of it. And I put it near the computer and it just quickly went away. And you were like, God dang, save a little bit. I'm like, I didn't know. I'm not, this I don't think would make me do the same thing. There's something different here. I fell there, in love with the lot 40 cash drink before. It's coming in on the very tail end. There's a faint hint of it. Hmm. What makes this special edition? On the very I think, tail or end. Or is, is it just because I know it's there? Yeah. On the very tail end, in the finish, something. I like it overall. I, I expected more. I expected more expected out of this special more. finishing. It's special. It's a special finish. Are you ready was, for me to reveal it, to you what you should be getting here? It was in a beer barrel. It was in a peated whiskey barrel. Oh, my God. I'm not getting that at all. I know. Yeah. <laughs> it's very, very faint on the tail end. You probably wouldn't because your, your peat palate's destroyed. destroyed. Better be over the top if I'm in. But peat. like I say, am I just, am I getting it because I know it's supposed to be there or is there just a very faint hint here? Still, overall, it's a very nice, it's a lot for, nice lot 40 cast strength release. Tastes a little younger. I, Tastes a little younger. It's not overly aged, no. Okay. I don't think. Yeah, because I remember the other one was like a warm blanket. It was a little heavier on the palate, probably. Yeah, and I wrapped as myself in it as the blizzard came in, but I had plenty of wood to put into the wood burning stove. Well, that's why I went into, you know, this is that, that Canadian rye, lighter, sweeter um, notes yeah. here. And you can tell by the color. It hasn't picked up too much cask influence. That's but, interesting. Okay. I yeah. get a little rye on the front, then I get a little barrel char on the back end. Hmm. Does it say what kind of peat? Just says Isla Peat, in case I tip it. Yep. <laughs> <crazy>. <laughs> oh my God. Dang it. Dang it. What are you doing? He likes to yell out, what are you doing? Warning tobacco use. Yeah, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Warm tub, spirit. Percolator. It says finished uh, 17 months. Finished 17 months task. in 150 liter yeah. first fill peated single malt casks. Not getting it. It's very light. Mm -hmm. It's very light. I, ex I, I expected more. Yes. But it's still good overall. I still like it overall. It's good, but I get no peat. I've got no peat in here. If you had a touch of peat, I'd be losing my mind. I like the rye. I like to go to a rye. I like a, a peppery rye. And if you added a peat to the pepper, I'd be I'd be laying on top of the barrel. Let's just say I'm getting a little pepper. You said pepper, a little pepper. They're now on the on the finish now. Been sitting there for a little bit. Um let's say Arash Nadi arranged for us to get this. <laughs> so special shout out to Arash. Yep. I went Nadi. You went uh, Arash Nadi. You went Arash, I went Nadi. <laughs> so well thank you uh, this is you know he's a friend um i want more lot 40. so yeah. i we've, think we've, what lot 40 is doing up in canada is well, great where are they based kind, kind of their limit their limited editions or their cast strength editions yeah, I dig them we i think we picked up the standard lot 40 yeah, and yeah you like know like yeah it's okay helicopters coming over yeah. top trash trucks driving wow, down the like street geez, dogs barking combat helicopters like an apache was rolling in coming to you from the ukraine <laughs> yeah Woo, what they're doing with the drones is stunning mm -hmm. so uh score it i'm ready stunned me i was in a, I was oh in like, i know you're i was in a pontificating mood and then you're like score Score! And I was like, God dang, you kind of caught me off guard. There, caught me off guard. Bringing you 87. 88. Let's okay. <laughs> right there with you. Right there with you. There. You stunned Come me. Come on. Got to keep yeah. you on yeah. track. No, I was getting all in there. I thought it was in Ukraine. <laughs> <laughs> all right. What else is going on? Anything else? I, I don't know if I I was just saying, I think we had picked up, we did the standard Lot 40 release. And, you know, it's okay. It's, it's really pretty average. The uh, but their, their special well, releases, yes. their cast strength editions, yes. they do uh, some good stuff. And I with. want to throw in thanks to all the friends of the show. We have a lot of friends of the show. 
that will link up with us and provide us with uh, with bottles that we can't find in Kansas. So we got a pretty good selection in Kansas, but friends of the show really help us round out our coverage. This is one we need to give some time because right now um, more of the peat is showing. Not still not heavy. More of the peat is showing on the palate. Uh, okay. Yeah, it's starting this. to come out now with a little bit of air, a little bit of water. It's still pretty light. Um, that's definitely the most that I've gotten from. But yeah, it's still right. it's still on the tail end. So it's here's still on what the I'll finish. say to Lot Forty though: Rye is already the strong grain. Rye is a a it's a ball puncher. I'm just gonna tell you, okay? Rye is powerful. There you have it. Yeah. It's, <laughs> just imagine that little speed bag. That's what Rye will do. Okay. I don't want to imagine that. <laughs> I know. I apologize. But for, I did. For putting the work, the word picture the in your brain. You, you then add in the peat, and peat can be a little bit of a in your face. Okay. <laughs> so you combine the two, and you're not sure what you're going to get. And right now I'm getting more rye than peat. Both are powerful. I'm with you that maybe a little curl of smoke is in the finish. Yeah. But if I read that, I would think more peat up front. Yeah. I got more rye up front. But you should yeah. get more rye. It's a rye. And that's why I thought when when you when I sat down here and you're like, oh, I'd already tasted it. I was like, well, damn, there goes the surprise. No. Nope. It's so faint, you didn't yeah, get I it. I didn't get rye. Yeah. Didn't peat. get rye. Peat. Sorry. Yeah. Peat. Peat. Yeah. Didn't get peat. So, I mean, no, it is. It, it's actually, pretty... I did get rye. I did not get peat. So. Uh, price point, I don't know. Uh, Rosh didn't include that. But uh, thanks to him. Uh, if you're in Canada and can get this, I'm sure this is a Canada exclusive. It's but probably I think it's worth trying. 320 Canadian, $75 US. That could be. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, just poking fun. Poking fun at our Canadian friends. Scotch it, you Scotch gods. Solange. Dummies. Dummies. <laughs>